you'll save loads of shots. So how many times does this happen? You hit great shots, you get up around the greens and then you take three or four shots to get, to get it in the hole and all that good play has gone to waste. So today we're going to have a look at wedge shots just off the green and help you save shots on the course. So to help save shots round the green, we're going to have a look at the pitching and chipping technique and how becoming consistent with the technique can help save your shots and get it up and down more often. So firstly, we've got to have a look at where are you going wrong and what is letting you down during your technique. So to begin, we're going to have a look at the most popular faults, what that causes and how you can improve your action to hit good shots. Okay, so number one is you've got that person who gets really flicky, doesn't use the body, and that affects the quality of their strike. So please, please don't hit wedge shots like that. You're not going to enjoy the results and it's going to waste multiple shots on the course. You also don't want to be that person that rushes the chip shot and feels like it's over with within a flash, who swings it back really short and has to power it up on the way through. But don't be that person that swings it too long, has to slow right down, hits it big thins, or hits it right in front of them. And you also don't want to be that person that stabs at the ball. So if you're one of those pitchers, Please, please stop doing that, guys. That's gonna waste you multiple shots on the course. Okay, so now you're thinking it sounds really complicated. You can't do this, you can't do that. So what can you do? Let's take a look. So if you want to improve your pitching, the first thing you need to do is focus on matching the swing lengths up to help control your rhythm. What does that mean? Okay, so matching your swing lengths to control your rhythm means that you need to focus on swinging back and through the same length to control the speed of your swing. So now you're focused on controlling the length of your swings, matching them up the same to control your rhythm and control the distance of your shot. And now the key to chipping consistently and striking it every time ball first is controlling the swing with your body turn and not with the hands and the wrists. So to do that, you need to focus on the lead wrist and the club face. So the lead wrist keeping that structure and not letting the wrist break down and controlling the club face, making sure the club face goes up towards the target and doesn't wrap over and get flicky and turn off to the left during the swing. So now you're gonna swing the same length back and through but you're going to control the downswing with the body turn, get your belly button facing the target when you finish and control the club face, making sure the club face is pointing up towards where you want the ball to go. So get focusing on those points to pitch successfully and I'll let you into a little secret. You'll save loads of shots. Hopefully that's helped improve your game and helped you save shots. If it has, I'd love to hear from you in the comments below. Drop me a thumbs up and more importantly, don't forget to hit that subscribe button below.